have guys quick update on the market the fed is going to continue to do its quantitative tightening you know um tightening the um uh, monetary policy the target for fed inflation is two percent so the fed will do all that it can to bring that inflation to about two percent um we're still in any season you know uh, some of the earnings are out tesla is out tesla actually beat his earning in fact it was the best earnings result in over a decade don't forget the s p 500 actually closed above 200 day moving average last week, uh, friday which was the close of the market it is a very significant um, point because that's a, a level of resistance that has not been broken the last uh, couple of months i mean it has tried to break that level for about three or four times but now it is it, it has been broken which is significant even though nasdaq did the same thing but for s p 500 you know what it means now um my darling intel intel disappointed as usual even though we knew that he was going to be a loss but it, uh, the uh, expectation was about 25 percent but what we saw was about 28 percent year over year which is uh, wrong for, i mean which is not impressive for um uh, uh, Intel, maybe it's the right time to actually reevaluate Intel. As I said, it, Intel is now occupying the largest position in my own portfolio. Guys, look at opportunities. You know, if you are not in the market already, you are missing out. You need to be in the market. Don't forget what I often say on this channel. It is time in the market, no time in the market. If you are not already in the market, guys, you may have lost about fifteen percent just the last two or and after three weeks of this this year. Come on guys, you really need to be in, in the market. Look at the, the opportunities that are still there. You know, some stocks are still below their uh, 200 day moving average. You know, you can still find value in the market. You know, this is the right time to get stocks. Not when the stocks are operating up higher 20% or more. You know, I mean, you don't know what the year is going to give. So um, at the end of the day, if the uh, projection was going to be 20%, I mean, I mean, you already missed about 15%. Look, it, it would be very tight for you to actually beat the market in the long run. So you need to be in the market now. Look for opportunity. The opportunity are still there. You know, look at the earnings. The earnings are actually good. You know, um, I mean, I, I didn't expect that uh, Tesla would do this good. But then, guys, Tesla boosts are about put your eyes on Tesla and many other stocks. Thank you for watching this channel. Kindly uh, give us a like and share. Cheers.